Welcome to Mama Cat's Home. Today I'm going to be sharing with you my Big Happy Planner, which is my faith planner. This is the one I use for my scripture writing plan that I make every month and I also share with you guys. If you would like to join me, go ahead and look in the link tree and it is at the very top. And next week I will have the new one for August out because it'll be time for us to get ready for it. But that is what I use this planner for and I use it to keep people's names that I want to pray for or certain things and also a weekly grateful thought but um, like I said the scripture writing plan is in the link tree down below in the description it's completely free you can print it whatever you want to do and it also have a um, hashtag that I use for Instagram is hashtag scripture writing with cat so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get this out of the way because you actually have seen this you know probably by now I used leftovers from a kit that I had gotten from so cute planner a long while back and then also some little uh, stickers from a happy planner book which I may end up pulling out I'm not sure though oh goodness I put that right on top of my Cricut mat that I just used because I just printed off something for me to use a print and cut something for me to use today I, I want to use this and I hope that it cut properly I didn't even check it and I didn't think about it until just now and I was actually supposed to put um, something behind this word and I didn't I've just now remembered that I did not do it but uh, I probably won't use that one anyway but not today anyways I have been using like tropical types theme uh, pineapples flamingos things like that in my other planners so I wanted to do the same type of thing in this one I have fuzzies and things all over my desk the cat keeps getting on my desk and I can't stop her so I'm not gonna try anymore but what I've been using is like pineapples and flamingos and just tropical stuff this is for the week of the 20th through the 26th of July so I'm going to go ahead and put the numbers down on here. I do have a couple of washies out. I do not know if I'm going to use both of them. One of them is horizontal. The other one is vertical. So I don't know how I'm going to use the one if I am going to use it. I think I want to put it down the side if it's not too wide because I just want to use it. It's so adorable. I don't usually pick washies that are like that, but it was in a set, so I didn't actually choose it. But yeah, I don't usually choose the vertical. I think that's vertical. I don't know. Today my brain is not with me and not happy with me today, so I don't know. But this is also the week of mine and my husband's anniversary. Our anniversary is on the 26th on Sunday, and it will be 24 years of marriage. And... It's been good, bad, and all the in-betweens. You know, that's the way life is. But I had these left over from So Cute Planner. It was just like a little uh, sheet she gave me. And then when I printed these, they ended up more orange than yellow. I don't know. I messed around with my ink settings on my printer because they weren't... Um, it wasn't doing like... As vibrant as I wanted and now as these did exactly the color that it shows but these are a little bit darker but that's okay the green is actually the same but I don't know now these stickers I got this one right here from a website I cannot remember it this was on the um, this part right here not the white background well yeah the black background too it was on the Cricut store and this part was on the Cricut store but this part right here I got from a website and this came for from let me find the name of it um it's um let's see how does it go it's an acronym free pretty things for you dot com and yeah it was just a website but I'm not exactly sure how I'm going to use these. I wanted to use this one and just have other ones in other places for later. Like, I'm not going to use every sticker that I printed today. But I wanted to have, um, I didn't want to waste as much sticker 
paper. That's what I'm trying to say. I'm going to go ahead and see if, oh, drop that, to see if I can put this on the side and it look okay or if it's not too wide. Actually, I think it's just perfect. So, this will go on this side. And I'm probably going to put it on both sides. But I'm not going to put it all the way up to the top because I want to put some washi there as well. Just use my Cricut, but don't know where I put my Cricut scraper. I think I probably put it behind my keyboard. Yes, I did. See, my key. this is where my keyboard goes to. So, yeah. Um, <laughs> it goes on this desk. I'm going to turn this this way because I don't normally cut or tear washi, whatever it is. Like, you know, that way. <laughs> Something. I don't know. Um, the reason why I wanted like the tropical type theme is because it just is summery and it's fun and, you know, I've just it's the time of the year that I crave watermelon more which I like watermelon any time of the year I'm gonna turn this sideways like I normally this side over here is wider than the other and um, every time that I ever put washi on the side which I don't do that very often or on the top here which I do all the time I find that one side is gonna have more um, more showing than the other like this one to fit between that line and there it goes all the way to the edge see and this one to fit to that line over you can see that there's an edge there that's not covered so these are not going to be printed exactly perfect I think they never are I don't think any book is printed exactly perfect um, I've never found a planner that was the same on both sides not ever I was going to cut this off on this end because it was a little bit crooked but I didn't want to waste a lot of washi and I almost forgot to do it and that would have caused my washi to snag and that would have been sad because it would have been a mess Okay, and this is the other washi I have, and um, it it smells like candy. I've used it. I, I want to say I've used it in every single spread this week. I did the first spreads for this week on Monday, and today is Wednesday. I'm still ahead. I usually try to get this one done on Thursday, or by Thursday, I should say. But um, that's my own deadline of when I want to have these done so that I can share them with you guys and also if there's anything I need to put in the next week or the week that I'm doing like this week oh I should have went all the way over I can fix it I can just put that back and tear it again it'll be just fine and if that line bothers me any, I can always put one of these little deco stickers down. Okay, so I have my little prayer things. Um, these actually have more uh, spaces on them than the others. So I think I'm just going to use two this time. Because this last time I, only, I used three. And, well, I mean, it is only Wednesday. But I haven't even used that yet. And I don't know if I'm going to yet. I don't. I just, so I'm going to just use two and then I'm going to separate them with one of these other stickers if they fit. I want to put this one that says stand tall, wear a crown and be sweet on the inside. I wanted to put it between the two and I know it's going to go up onto this one but I feel like that's going to be okay. I'm not going to worry about it but I'm going to see if I can do this. I need to white out where it says notes. I don't want it to come over here at all because I'm going to, you know, use that spot for um, my grateful thought of the week or thankful thought, whichever one you want to say. What I'm, one thing that is really, truly um, something uh, that I'm grateful for. And, um, yeah, that's what that's for. So, let me see if I can, oh yeah, I think it'll be perfect. 
And like I said, I know it's going to go up into this one a little bit, but that's okay. I just won't put any more stickers in that box at all. So I'll have all the room I can for my writing for the week. And um, this one and this one I've just seen, it's just, they're just too big. They're not really going to work. And I also wanted to use one of these for um, my, um, actually, you know what, I think I'll, oh, it's too big to go over there, though. What I should have done is just put this one down over here and not put that one there. Let me see. Do I want to do this? Do I not want to do this? I don't want to move that pineapple because I'm afraid it'll mess it up. It says a grateful heart and a, is a happy heart, but it's too wide. Even if I scoot it all the way over. But, let me try something. I may be totally ruining this sticker. I may be totally ruining my thought process too. I don't know yet, but we'll see. I'm going to cut it just on this line to separate those two boxes. Okay. And I want to put this down here. So I can... I wanted to write my grateful thought on this sticker. But it's... It's just not going to, hmm, let's see. I'm going to white out this part, this thankful for. And then put that, oh, come on. Hold on, let's see. Let's see if I can, these are just going to be too big. I should have made them much smaller. They're going to take up way too much space. I wasn't thinking about how big they were whenever whenever it's on the screen and then you stick it actually I'm gonna put this up here for my scripture writing plan that's what I was planning on doing I honestly was thinking that this sticker here and this sticker here were two separate stickers in the beginning and then I don't know I don't know where I'm going with all this stuff because I cut that crooked too. There we go. Got that fixed. Let's take this one down. This is where my scripture writing plan is going to go. Right there. This is where I've been putting it every week lately. Um, if I put this down, it's just so big and that won't work. I really wish that I would have Um, made that smaller. I'm going to try something real quick just to see if this will work because I'm wasting so much of your time and mine as well because I do have videos to edit today and I do have dishes to do but otherwise my chores are done for the day I think. I think I've done all of them except that. All right, I'm going to put this down here and then put this like this. And I know I'll have to write smaller than I normally do, but I, what I wanted to do was write right here the grateful thing, the what I, you know, my something for the week anyway. And that was so crooked and a mess. Okay, let's hope that this works. I maybe shouldn't have put it. It's still crooked. Okay, this is the very last time I'm picking it up. I'm going to pick it up, and I'm going to move it down some anyway because I wanted it off that up there some. All right, and then I'll write my grateful thought right there. I know it's going to be a, a very small space, but I'm okay with that. It's just going to be fine. I still want to use these because that's the whole reason I did these. 
but if I do, I know I'm going to be taking up so much space, but let me just, this one says, just be who God made you, and I'll put that one there, and yeah, I can still write on that a little bit, that's fine, I think that'll be fine, um, and then if I put this one in, it says be sweet, the only reason I did it is because I always say be sweet, but honestly, I don't think I want it on here. Let me see what, oh, oh, it's a heart. But I never did do this cover either. I think I'll stick it on here on this part. No, I don't want to stick it there because there's already something like that there. I mean, there's something there anyway. Let's find a page that maybe it doesn't have anything. See, it won't look right with that one. Y'all, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have done this right now. I'll put it down here on this one because I think it matches the colors. So I don't waste that sticker. And I think it's so cute. Okay, so sorry. There's the cover. It's messed up right there because I got it from Tuesday morning. Still sad that our Tuesday morning is closing. It might be closed by now. I haven't been back over there. Um... There's another grateful sticker. I can use it next week. And this one, because of the way it cut, I don't know if I'm going to be able to use it at all. But I'll see next week if I can, or I'll just cut it off right there. One or the other. These I'm going to save back for another time. And then I'm just going to put some of these little guys in there because they're adorable. I just hit a button put this one over here um I don't know see I have all these other pineapples and stuff on the side and the all that fun stuff maybe I should move him up here or her or whatever is it a boy or a girl who knows they're wearing scuba gear put this one here because I just wanted to use these because I had them for so long and there's no sense in just wasting them and just let them sit and not be sticky anymore. Put that one there. I'll put that one there. Okay, so now I'm going to write in the scripture writing plan for this week. You don't have to do this. The reason why I do this is because it just helps my brain. So, I have done this in a little bit of a weird way because I don't have any lines or the Monday through Sunday. So, I'm going to write Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And I have given myself... A lot less room than what I normally would so let's just see if we can do this thing okay Psalm 91 14 and 15 did I say 41 and 15 14 and 15 okay I don't know second Peter 2 19 Romans 6.14 Galatians 3.13 1 Corinthians 8.9 John 8.31 and 32 John 3, 16 and 17. And then I'm going to mark right here because that means that, that was done. Actually, I probably should have went ahead and had this scripture writing plan ready for you this week. But I didn't do it. I am thinking about August. I have some, you know, some ideas of what I want to do. I just haven't finished it. So, always check in my um, community tab on my Instagram or just look at my link tree and
and um you i need to fill this out but i did i don't i never do really in my faith planner but i think i may next month i don't know but just check the link tree my community tab or instagram and that way you'll know before the video comes out if i have the august one ready and I'll, you know i'll let you guys know i think it turned out really cute as i said i use this for my scripture writing and honestly this day and this day i didn't think i was going to have enough to write my thought in so i just put a very small thought down but i am loving the way this planner is working out for me i think this may be my favorite faith planner so far and i've had well other than just a regular notebook of course but i've had uh two other different faith planners both of them i think were 18 months one of them might have been 12 months but i do believe that this is my favorite one because the layout is just about perfect for me and honestly it makes it really fun and easy and yes i did put bigger rings i put some metal disc in here but otherwise everything is the same as the way it came except i did put some um paper back here just in case i needed it but if you want my script writing plan like i said it's in my link tree it's free if you want to join me in writing your scriptures every day then please join me and enjoy it uh while that you know you do it and learn from the lord and also if you want me to put you on my prayer list let me know that as well and um that's all i have if you like my channel, go ahead and subscribe and hit the bell so you be notified whenever I upload. Also, leave me a comment down below. What are you studying right now? And remember, don't take any wooden nickels and be sweet.